The Northern and Coastal Plains Mom, what are plains? A flat and level land is called a plain. Tell me more. The plains of India include the Northern Plains and the Coastal Plains. Let me show you. The Northern Plains lie towards the south of the Himalayas. They stretch from Punjab to Assam. Many rivers which originate in the Himalayas flow through the northern plains. These rivers carry water throughout the year. They also bring with them broken pieces of rocks, sand and silt. The fine silt deposited by the rivers is called alluvium. It is fertile and very good for crops. The area watered by a river and its tributaries is called its basin. Three rivers, Satluj, Ganga and Brahmaputra, and their tributaries have formed the northern plains. Where does the Ganga originate from? River Ganga originates from the Gangotri glacier in the Himalayas. Yamuna is its main tributary. The Ganga and its tributaries flow through Uttarakhand, Uttar Pradesh, Bihar and West Bengal. In West Bengal, the river splits into two branches. One branch enters Bangladesh and is called Padma. It joins the Brahmaputra. The other branch flows through West Bengal and is called Hooghly. Mom, do we also have states in the northern plains? Yes, of course. Punjab, Haryana, National Capital Territory of Delhi, Uttar Pradesh, Bihar, West Bengal and Assam lie in the northern plains. Farming is the main occupation. People grow rice, wheat and sugar cane. The people of Punjab are fond of makke ki roti, sarso ka saag and lassi. Many people of Haryana are engaged in cattle rearing and dairy farming. Delhi has many famous monuments such as the Red Fort, Kutub Minar, India Gate, Humayu's Tomb, Jama Masjid, Lotus Temple and Akshadham Temple. Uttar Pradesh is famous for guavas and mangoes. Tell me something about the other states. Bihar is famous for lychees. Bhagalpur is a center of silk weaving. Rice, jute and tea are the main crops grown. Darjeeling has many tea gardens. Assam is famous for tea and silk. Thank you mom, this was very informative.